Hey, welcome back. In this video, we're going to talk about the Flare Infinity and why I think it's such a great option for people trying to quit smoking. I'm Kenny. On this channel, I do reviews like this and other vapor related content. If you're new here, consider subscribing. Before we get into the video, though, please take a minute to check out the links in the description. Products like this and others won't exist in a few months if we don't act now. There's a series of bands, flavor bands, and hardware bands that are making their way through the White House, through the FDA, and through Congress, and we need everybody to voice their opposition. So all the relevant information and links will be in the description. Please take the time to sign the petitions and make the phone calls. It's extremely important. I will say the Flare Infinity does have some downsides and drawbacks, but even despite those, I think it's a great option for people who are trying to quit smoking or just pod system users. Chargers, I think it's such a stupid thing to do. Everybody has USB cables. Come on, like put a USB charger in there and then you don't have to worry. I think this is a really cheap way to try to make extra money when people lose the charger. Huge con for me right there. Other thing I'm not a huge fan of is the plastic construction of this. The body, the pod, and the bottom all seems to be made of plastic. Granted, it does feel nice. It's a hard, durable plastic. I can't imagine this would break or anything like that. So that's, I'm not taking like major points off for, for it, but it would just feel so much better and be such a better pod system overall if it were metal. On the flip side of that coin though, if this were metal, it would be much more expensive than it is. And the last thing that really bugs me about this device is the pod itself. Now, I do love the mouthpiece. It's extremely comfortable and major points for that. However, the pod, is extremely loose, like very, very loose. The magnets are not very strong. There's not enough tension in here. There's no uh, pressure fitting. It's extremely loose. Again, repeating myself, but the magnets aren't strong at all. I, in fact, lost my first pod. I was out to eat with my dad and my sister when she was in from California. And, you know, I was like stealth hitting this at the bar and holding it in, but um, I lost the pod. So somehow between my pocket and my hand, the pod fell off and got lost and luckily I had another pod system on me, but that if this was your only system and that was your only pod that you had on you and you're out, like that would be a major issue for me. Flare, guys, you really need to address that. This needs to either pressure fitting, it needs to be extremely tight so that can't just fall out like that. Like it's, 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 uh, it's loose to the point where I have to make this point. Other than that, the pod does go in nicely. Like you cannot put it in the wrong way because of those magnets will just force it out. So that is nice and it does go in nice. It clicks in, but it does not stay in. This is a closed system, so it does come with pre-filled juices. I can't find where the capacity is listed on their website or on the product itself. I do know uh, the ones that I have and the ones that I'm seeing on their site, which is let me tell you what the site is now because I can't link to it. It's flarevapor.com. Okay, so they are one mil. I take that back. It is a one mil capacity pod, better than average, and that's going to come into effect later when we talk about price. But the flavors they have for these are impressive. So not only are they delicious, they have a ton of them. And they have multiple different ways to buy this. So let's talk about that first. You can buy it by itself, just the battery and the charger. The charger is like a little docking station that plugs directly into USB, so it's small and easy to lose. That's how I lost it, no pods included. And that for that, they want $24.99. So reasonable price for something that's pretty, pretty damn well, well built. But you can also buy the variety pack. So it comes with the starter kit, I guess we'll call it. It comes with the battery and eight different pods. So eight flavors. And that's one of the reasons why this is such a great starter kit for beginners if you're quitting smoking because nobody wants to quit with tobacco. So it's got eight other flavors for you to try. And as I said earlier, I'm a big fan of the flavors that I've tried so far. Even their tobacco is good. Let's talk about the different flavors. I'm going to read them off for you right here. Virginia tobacco, cool mint, mighty mango, cherry, menthol, blue mint, melon breeze, strawberry, blueberry, and peach. In the variety pack, mine came with peach, blueberry, melon breeze, strawberry, Virginia tobacco, blue mint, cool mint, and menthol. 
I do like the silver inlay on the branding on this. Other than that, it is really clean. I like the way this feels in my hand. It's a little bit bigger than uh, most stick pod systems. Like it's taller and a little bit wider. The corners on the bottom sometimes kind of press into my hand. I can feel it. It's not uncomfortable, but it's not like, it's not ridiculously comfortable either. I can't find anywhere what capacity battery is in here, but I have noticed it seems pretty standard. So I'm gonna guess around 300 so with heavy use that'll get me me personally maybe half three quarters of a day for somebody who's not using it as much as I do it'll last probably all day into the next don't lose the charger like I did you should be okay oh really quick I know I'm jumping around a little bit but uh, what I noticed on on the pods themselves is that they kind of like a jewel pod they have little clips on either side so I do believe these can be refilled if you pride those up and then fill them with your own juice if you don't want to spend the money buying their pods also pricing on a four pack of pods for this we're looking at $16 online not sure the retail price but if they're around that 16 bucks that's pretty good value if you're on that track like if you're buying flavor buying pre-filled pods that's as good a value as you're gonna get. The last thing that concerns me with this device, and I'll let you listen, ready? It didn't do it on that one, hold on. It like, it doesn't immediately stop when I stop drawing on it. Sometimes it, it, it sounds like it's like still firing for maybe a second and then it'll stop. Not really sure what's going on with that. It was definitely concerning the first time I, I hit this and pulled it away from my mouth and it was kind of still going before it stopped. Not a big fan of that. Would love to see that kind of cleaned up, taken care of. Not sure what's causing it or how that could be fixed. But like I said, it was startling at first. I'm not worried about it now. It's not something I'm concerned about, but it is definitely something I wanted to mention. The 50 milligram salt nic nicotine strength on this is a little high for me, and I'm gonna get all nicked out doing this video. It's definitely effective. Like if you're gonna quit smoking for people who have a hard time quitting, like that 50 can definitely get them there. Like that's that, that's that kick in the balls, that, that sensation that they need, that throat hit and everything. A little too much for me. I prefer like a 30 with my pod systems. Maybe down the road, Flare will offer different strengths that you could choose from. I think that would be a really good move. Where this thing really sells for me is with its overall performance. Despite the shortcomings that I mentioned, it's, it's raw performance, the way it hits is truly fantastic. Like a beautiful, beautiful hit. One of the most satisfying mouth to lungs I've had from a pot system in a very long time. It's flavorful, it's intense, it's robust. It's very, very satisfying for me. And it's just a draw that I end up reaching for. So despite everything that I was mentioning earlier, I can really kind of overlook a lot of those things because it's such an awesome performer. That's all the information, that's my take on it. I'm gonna leave it up to you whether or not to look into it more and purchase, but you can find it on their website at flarevapor.com. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down below. I try to stay as active as possible in the comment section. And if you like this video, found it helpful, make sure you like that smash button, get subscribed, and press the bell to be notified when I post new content. Guys, don't forget to check the links and get active make your voices heard and oppose these bans. Tell them we vape and we vote. And if you ban anything, we will not vote for you. I really appreciate you taking the time to spend it here watching the stuff that I create. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Kenny and I will see you in the next video.